let's solve some more examples based on the quadratic equations and with the help of the quadratic equations formula so we will say as already discussed that discriminants relations between discriminant and the quadratic from the quadratic equations and now so we will have find out the discriminant and we we know well about the discriminant value of d and now consider sir how we will find the discriminant if the discriminant is not given if the discriminant is given then find the value of the uh, constant or variables okay so let's say start with some example here is the examples example ones example example one okay find the discriminant of the quadratic equations quadratic equations let's say i have a quadratic equations x square minus 4x plus 1 is equal to 0 okay this is the quadratic equations now so it says right here solutions okay solution okay this is solution solutions we have we have quadratic equations x square minus 4x plus 1 is equal to 0 okay comparing with uh, the quadratic equations now comparing comparing the above equations with standard standard formula of quadratic equations that is a x square plus b x plus c is equal to zero okay so a is equal to we have find here one b is find here is minus four the c is find here plus one okay what is completely so we know that the quadratic equations now discriminant now discriminant discriminant d is equal to under root b square minus 4 ac by 2a okay this is the formula of discriminant b, d is equal to b square minus 4 ac is a discriminant so this will not be a discriminant also b square minus 4 ac so substitute the value of the abc okay so substitute substitute value so d is equal to b is given as minus 4 square minus 4 into a is 1 into c is 1 okay so here we got here 3 4 4 just 16 minus 4 okay under root so 16 minus 4 12 this is equal to root 12 here we have find uh, the value of this root 12 this will be always be root 12 we can consider here 2 into 2 into 3 so 2 root 3 what is so here is the answer 2 root 3 so discriminant is here 2 root 3 so answer will be d is equal to 2 root 3 what is let's us some more example so that we can clear it okay so example second second okay let's have an example second so here keep in that so if the discriminant discriminant of the equations 
quadratic equation special equations here means that quadratic equations given here 6x square minus bx plus uh, c plus 1 is equal to 0 okay this is 2 is equal to plus 2 is equal to 0 is 1 plus minus plus 2 is equal to 0 is 1 so find the value of b in the equations okay in the equations okay so let's find the value of b how uh, we will find here so let's find the value of b so solve solutions right here b have b have 6ax square minus bx plus 2 is equal to 0 okay this and uh, and as uh, comparing with comparing with ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 okay so let's uh, compare sorry uh, let's uh, compare here compares so we will say a is called a here 6 b here minus b and the c here c here plus 2 okay so discriminant now thus now discriminant d is equal to b square minus 4ac okay substitute value d is 1 is equal to b square value is always b b minus b minus b whole square minus 4 into a value is 6 into c value is 2 okay so 1 is equal to b square b square minus 48 okay b minus 4 ac 48 so under root this so here is the under root values so if we write here 1 is equal to under root b square minus 48 okay so 1 is equal to b square b minus root 48 what it's so we can say that b is equal to 1 by root 48 sorry 1 minus root 48 this value and 48 now we know there's uh, 48 can be uh, can be uh, 48 b square 1 is called b square minus 48 uh, b square is equal to so b square will always be 48 so 48 is given here b square minus 4 ac so b square minus 4 ac is given here discriminant as a point of use so we will write here discriminant d is equal to b square minus 4 ac so if we write this and the discriminant we know that this discriminant can be written in form of so, this equations so the discriminant d will always be as like uh, this so b square minus 4 ac is always being discriminant so we can write here so b square so we can convert this uh, discriminant as a form so b can be written as uh, b square b square minus 48 okay so b square will always be root value so it becomes a 48 48 sir so b square is equal to 48 uh, and its value is 1 so c here will be 49 b square is equal to 49 then b is equal to under root 49 is equal to 7 so this will be answer of this uh, and the value of b will always be a uh, 7 
So this is the answer of these questions because after, after transposing and uh, removing these roots, uh, we can find the answer of the given questions. So such questions will come and in front of us and uh, generally is, and uh, by general methods, if we use our common sense, we can solve these types of the questions very easily. Nothing, anything problem will happen with it. So, okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Bye-bye. Take care of yourselves.